Ronan Murray, how are you? Not so bad. Sligo Rovers for 2019, your, your thoughts on the campaign ahead? Yeah, it's exciting times. Uh, you can feel the atmosphere there in, in, at the launch that uh, everybody's ready to go and now that you can see Friday night coming, we're playing at Dundalk, so it's exciting and it's just ready to get going. Yeah, you're playing against your old team as well. Last time we spoke to you, it was before the FAI Cup final. You won a double with Dundalk as well. Why are you now a Sligo Rovers player? Uh, well, I enjoyed my time at Dundalk and uh, loved every minute of it, but uh, I felt like I need more time on the pitch and uh, that's why I, mo I moved home and, and played for Sligo. Was there much in the decision process to actually move back towards home again as opposed to living away? Yeah, of course. Uh, Dundalk was four, four and a half hours from home, so it was a nine-hour round trip so it was tough to see family and friends and, and stuff like that so I think that's important as well in your life that you need um, as well as success and we had a lot of success and I'm, I'm grateful for it but uh, I'm, I'm looking forward to my time at, at Sligo and uh, hopefully we can we can bring the club forward. Yeah it's a new Sligo in terms of Liam Buckley, new manager, some new players, some players coming in from abroad as well that maybe over here we haven't heard too much of. How is the squad shaping up and how has pre-season gone? Pre-season gone quite well uh, new players coming in uh, it's exciting to see what they're going to be like uh, but it's going to take time to adjust everything's going to take time to everybody bet in new players new manager uh, so it's exciting uh, but it's, it's going to be down to hard work and, and, and getting points on the board early doors getting the fan, home fans on side and uh, getting our atmosphere back in the showgrounds yeah, because in the League of Ireland, most years, every player who signed for someone, you know who they are and who they've played for in their history. The number of players that Liam and Dave Campbell have brought in, some of them have come from other leagues and, and not too much known about them, but that surprise element could actually be a good thing for you guys against other teams that they don't really know what to expect. Yeah, exactly. Uh, it could be a surprise uh, element to it in the first, uh, first round of games and s see what these players are like. Um, from what I've seen so far, they've been, they've been good additions, so... Hopefully, you can bring in one or two more, and we'll have a good squad uh, to be, ch be challenging this season. Yeah, the fixture list here: Dundalk away, opening night, quarter to eight on Friday. Back to your old club, back to the Champions. They've a new manager as well, some new signings, but the majority of their squad are there. So, a team you know quite well, and a game you'd hope to, to start. And, and um, I know you picked up a little knock, but from a point of view of trying to pick up points early in the season. Yeah, well, we all know uh, Dundalk's a well-oiled machine by now. Um, I don't think the change of manager is going to be much of a difference. I think they're going to be still that formidable force that they have been in the recent years. So uh, it's going to be a good test for us and see where we're at as a team. And uh, we might have to ride our luck uh, a little bit, but if we come away with any, any point, it'd be, it'd be successful and, and move on. How bad is your injury and how long do you expect to be out for? Uh, I'm, I'm touch and go for Friday, but definitely uh, fit, uh, hopefully, for St. Pat's uh, at home. And Ronan, just finally from the point of view of, of aims for the season, you, know, you talked to Court and Dock, Rovers, Pat's Waterford there, going for Europe, and then the rest of the teams, you're not quite sure, there's two coming up, Finn Harps, New City, and then the other three, yourselves, Derry and Bowes, you know, where do you see, obviously points are important, but where do you see things this season in terms of aims? Personal aims is just try and play every minute uh, that I can on the pitch and, and take it from there, really. As a team, it just depends on how we, we bet in together. Uh, we've done well so far in pre-season. Um, just have to keep the head down and, 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 and work hard and, and uh, you never know where we'll, where we'll end up in, at the end of the year. Ronald, thanks for being the best of luck. Thank you. Cheers, man. Thank you, sir.